students walk into a bathroom, there's a certain expectation of privacy, which is why they don't think the school should be installing cameras. But the school says its stalls are different from these. They go all the way from the floor up to the ceiling. So the school is okay with putting these cameras in the common spaces. But parents disagree. I never would have thought that it would be on anybody's mind to put cameras in bathrooms anywhere. Trevor Garrett can't flush out the frustration. The first word that comes to mind is disgusted. Since learning cameras are now close to these toilets. Is why would you put cameras in, in students' bathrooms? It's absurd. And this is talking about just lack of privacy, invasion of privacy, criminal invasion of privacy, in my opinion. Windsor Charter Academy alerted parents in a newsletter. The school's executive director says this new surveillance near the sinks improves safety. We had surveillance cameras in our plan from the very start. At this time, our job is to make sure that our students are safe and that the building is secure. Gary worries about his girls or other students who may use the bathrooms to change for after-school activities. My gut reaction is, um, I, I'm a father. I'm going to protect my children, and I'm going to protect any kids in here. It makes me really uncomfortable going in there just because I know that a lot of people have access to it, but I don't know who's watching me or why they're watching me while I'm in the bathroom. The cameras will only be confined to the high school bathrooms because of the floor to ceiling stalls. You have your traditional stalls as we do in our middle school. You would never put a camera in a, in a bathroom like that. It does the opposite of what they want to do with student privacy. Uh, it actually invades their privacy. But parents like Garrett say the stalls don't matter. Students shouldn't be caught on camera in any bathroom. The school's executive director tells me that only administration and the technology team will have access to this video, and the video won't be viewed constantly. There won't be someone constantly monitoring it. Instead, it will only be accessed if there's a need for it. Emily Allen, Fox 31. Thank you, Emily. Developing right now.